All right, next floor up, level 730-703 here. We need to grab, what is it, over here? It is, oh, this one. Data collecting. Can we data collect our uh, robots? Only time will tell. I know, I'm I know I have to go over a little bit on my timeline a little bit just because of the first level of the night. It is in. <laughs> ah, here we go, we need to dock the mini bots. And we have a new mechanic upon us. So the robots are going to be consistently moving on the red line. So that is our main gimmick of this floor. Now the robots are going to follow exactly where this device is. This little thing right here. So uh, robots will follow whatever the red line you make it in. So you make a straight line into the dock. The robots will follow it. As they also clean up said line alongside it too. They're the Squiffers from Splatoon 3. They clean up paint. <laughs> that's the exact same thing. Oh, goodness. All right. Well, that's the name of the story right here. This is how this level works. So, what you have to do now is get paint onto lines here that the robots will follow. And trying, hopefully for the best, that the robot will not nix any problems because there's also liquid all over the place. And if the robot hits it, or if you hit it and make water over the place, yeah, the robot ain't gonna do nothing with it. Why did you not follow the path I led you to? Hate this. <laughs> Here, there's, there is a path there. You just gotta follow it. There you go. No! Okay, you didn't like that path to begin with. Now you're stuck on the red line again. That's fine. There we go. Aha! Pathfind to victory! This is such a cool little concept. <laughs> of just this robot just following the path that you've given it and hope for the best it goes right in the dock. Wow, it's a pretty powerful little robot if it's... Uh, okay, good. It fits itself. Wah! Man, if I saw, I swear, if it got stuck right there and had to reset the floor again, I'd be a little, a little, uh, a little angry at the moment, wouldn't you say? All right, time for the third one. Third one is all over coast in this place. Let's see here. That's the yeah. There's bot number three is over here. So. The one thing you can, or the fact is, you gotta send it. You have to send this robot through the containment. So, hopefully, you just draw the best you can without having to dump any liquids, and you could easily get through this pretty easily. Do 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 do. Uh, the robot's following the path, but it landed on the pink goo. Of course, it did. I gotta pick it up or at least wash it come on robot no don't you get stuck and you also you can't pick up the robot so you're gonna have to do some cleaning which obviously they give you the worst machine possible to do this in the uh, vacuum cleaner the super scrubber there we go that clean that stuff out of there and more stuff is breaking of course it does. <laughs> oh, fun stuff indeed. All right, robot is. Did it get stuck again? Oh. Okay. It followed the closest path it could possibly do, and that was over here. Well, it certainly did the trick. Now it did it. Oh, oh boy, no. Well, it was supposed to be a very safe environment. It's not very safe anymore. There we go. Oh. No, it got stuck on the thing again. Why does it keep getting stuck on the pink goo? It's supposed to follow the red stuff. The red paint. Well, at least luckily it's following the closest red line it could possibly do. Hey, it saved me the trouble. <laughs> Despite everything, it did me it helped me out. And then, there we go. That's dock number three. Now for the fourth one. 
This guy is walking around like so. We'll paint this stuff down like this. We'll get him to go like that way. We gotta push these things out of the way. Put it out of there. And we'll push these things out of the way. Get these things to break the liquid in there because it's turned up water anyway. Yep. All right, now we're gonna get across this part. What's that down there? A, do a welding helmet? No thanks, we're good. All right, now we got this bad boy. We can just get him across here. Here, there we go. And hopefully it'll just avoid these boxes together and go right into the dock. Like a so. Please let it work out as intended. That's gonna follow the most of the majority of the red line. Go left, go left. Oh, it's gonna go right, isn't it? Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Totally fine. We can do this right here. Oh yeah. It'll still follow oh, these boxes. It's gonna hit the boxes. It's going to hit the box. No! There we go. Fall around the liquid. Fall over the water. Go into the dock. There you go. Good job! That's like the best one I've had all night. <laughs> Goodness. Oh, that's fun. But we're at the end of our level here. We are at the promotion level at long last. See, it didn't take nearly as long. The reactor core is unlocked. <laughs> reactor core? Okay, here we go. Reacting to our endeavors. Let's promote ourselves to the next floor, shall we? So, again, as I did before, all react, all the uh, promotion floors is everything you've learned up to a certain point in the floor itself. In some fashion. So, we have laser, we have uh, go karts, or our, our drones. We need to get the drones um, onto the uh, laser, connect on these laser tools here, so they can uh, fix everything. So, because our lasers are we use to power up the reactor core is in a fixed location. We can't do anything with them. So, what we have to do is basically move all the drones that are on the floors here into the correct spots. Nothing more and nothing less. It's not technically a very hard floor. Again, this floor is easier than the one we had previously. So... Do do... Let me see if all this went into place because what this lens does is basically focuses all everything into a grandiose one light. Which in turn gets locked in place and we don't have to worry about it anymore. Good. Now we just have to get around the floors of these two la these two lazy bones right here. And I think, yes, and we also we need to use said lasers to power up machines. Because the machine claws here actually help produce the way to get the way forward in a certain degree of sorts. So I need to move these boxes out of the way so we can get the lasers uh, over to the other side. There we go. So now I can move this laser over onto this corner here. See, the fact is that this is an actual physical puzzle, rather than a physics-based thing, like previously. No, no. There we go. Got him. There we go. No, don't pick up the box! <laughs> no! Oh, the, the cart pushed the thing out of the way. A slight annoyance. Only by slight. No, 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 no. Come on. I had this right the earlier. Now it's gonna give me tedious. Tedious is what it is. I had it working. I just gotta get this thing in the right spot. Hey, don't push me. You're gonna push me that way? Fine, so be it. The other way, the other mirrors are supposed to, you know, position the mirrors in the two different directions so you don't have it across the thing, but you can supposedly get this thing to work without any 
problem. See? Come on, get that in there. And if a, if a, if a claw picks it up, it'll stick it in the claw and won't move. There, I got those lights. Okay, good. The lights are not breaking apart anymore. Good. Oh, boy. And now we got the bot over here. Good. Awesome. Oh, there's a purple hat up there. Good luck trying to get it down because the thing doesn't move anywhere else, so... I think the harder... this, this I think the tease of this thing is the uh, just the concept of the liquid, I really think, in that terms of grand scheme of things. So it's, it's over here. Follow this line down. I think I can follow this line down here. If not, I'll have to go around. Just so I'll get on there for now. Did it? It hit it. It. Oh, where's okay? I need to find a broom. I need to find a broom here. Thing. Well, I can move these out of the way. Get out of the way. The bot. The the bot needs to move around. The thing is flying around. There we go. All right, let's get this thing out of here, shall we? Come on, Mr. Drones. Time for you to drive along here. Come here. Booyah! No! What are you doing? Robot, what are you doing? It is moving forward slightly. I'm wondering what is it going to do. It's following, it's trying to follow the red line. <laughs> Oh, robotics! What? How do they work? All right, can I actually clear? I can just clear this red line. Knock this over! Knock this over! I want to. The time I want to knock something over, it won't knock over. There we go. That fixes the issue. Now it's going to go close closest to the red line it can possibly done. Oh no! No! Now you're stuck right there. Why? There's no need for you to be stuck there. There we go. I definitely will have to now have to find the broom now. Just get on the line, you stupid robot. <laughs> stupid robots! Do the non-rescue! That was supposed to break. Look, there's no red lines now. You can restore yourself back to normal, buddy. All right, where's a broom? <laughs> I need to find a broom. Where is a broom here? I think we have to use the cleanup module, which is that uh, scrubber. Let's get the scrubber and let's scrub up this floor now. Hopefully the back of the drone was not completely, you know, stuck. Get the water out of here. Oh, I can actually push it with this thing. Come on, buddy. Oh, no! <laughs> I'm all the crazies! Okay, are you gonna fix yourself? Instead of just hitting the wall like you're always doing right now? Come on, drone. Fix yourself. Ah! I smack it. Come on, I'm gonna move you. Oh, I'll make you work. Regardless. Clean up that paint. Alright, are you glitched? Yes, indeed, you are. Thank you. I hope you're not glitched. Oh, good. There we go. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, dang it. Well, at least it's going to follow the red line. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That is too funny. Too funny for words. Too funny for words. All right. Um, Because that was a fun one. Let's get that one right to the center, uh, the center goal here. Come on, buddy. Follow that light. Follow the red line. Follow the painted road. Follow the painted road. Yay! You're now in spot. Now it's for the last one. Alright, what are we doing over here? We have to get prisms in place, looks like. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Okay, you got. Um, I need to put you somewhere, don't I? Can I actually pull you up? I can. I can pull you somewhere and you'll be good to go. All I have to do is get you powered and then move everything in place. And we can manufacture these things? 
How does that work? <laughs> How do you manufacture these mirrors in the fashion? This is not portal. This is not aperture science. I thought this was the Amazon building. <laughs> this is how this is how they make all the stuff in quick succession. They don't make they see they just only ask people to think that they're buying stuff from vendors. All they are is basically, hey, we just put the patent into the 3D printer and booyah, you can get yourself a patented good item at cheaper the cost. <laughs> okay, why did the mirror just flung faster that way? That shouldn't have happened. Come on. Urgent mirror. I want you to turn. Turn. I want you to turn so you can put the laser into the right spot. Because I have to get the... I have to carry the stupid drone over the bars using the cranes we just had earlier. Why aren't you just turning? That's all I want you to turn so I can get you in spots. Come here. There we go. That's all I wanted you to do. Now I can move this bad boy. Oh wow, well look at that. Oh, that was almost got to work. No! <laughs> Stupid mirror, now you're in my way. <laughs> ah, oh no. I need to get back over there. Move another prism in place. Come on, prism. Help me out, help a, help a, help a employee out, will ya? Like I had it working there just for a split second. I just pulled it away for no apparent reason. Come on. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. What's had working? There we go. Pull this guy out of the way. There we go. Got him. Pull that thing over us. There we go. There we go. Yay, I got my drone. Woo! Get this bad boy up. Now it's just a paint along a good line. And we got this floor completely done and dusted. Here we go. Did follow it quite nicely, in fact. No! Don't make any more of a mess! Stop! Stop what you're doing, drone! You're going crazy! You're going mad with power! No, drone! No! Well, you ever found that feeling when you're between a drone and a hard place? Yep. I found myself in that predicament too, right now. Just follow the find the path. Just do the path, buddy. You stupid drone. <laughs> you stupid robot. <laughs> no, no, no. In grand fairness, the fairness to everyone else, the robot is only as smart as the user who made it and programmed it. And right there. Good. Can we actually get better AI now? <laughs> Yay! We've powered the reactor core. Da-da! Yes, sir. Let's go. B? Not bad at all.